Good morning, YouTube. Man, I'm George Page, aka the Emperor of Female Body and Talk, coming to you live, live on YouTube. <clears throat> well, folks, I hope you had enjoying your um, Labor Day weekend. You know, it's a day where you remember those people who sacrifice their lives and their um, freedoms for us, and for us to have freedom. So, anyway, um, you know, um, early this week I was having an interview coming up, but well, things didn't always go the way you planned. You know, I had to, you know reach out to this person and we got together and we, you know, we, we, we put a time together, but I, you know, I want to be seen. I want to be certain to make sure we're positive on this. So we, we just talked a while ago. We got everything together. So anyway, this is one Miss Capucine LeCunt. He's, you know, Miss Clunt is LeCunt is a, a IFP pro fiction competitor. And this is my first time interviewing a fiction competitor. Now I have interviewed, or actually it'd be my second time, my first time with a pro. My first time was with my dear friend, Miss uh, Liz uh, Curtis. And Capucine is a beautiful young woman. She has been competing for quite some time. Around about 2018, so actually 2017, she earned a pro card. And she was, originally, she competed as a, comp uh, comp uh, sorry, as a uh, bikini competitor. But because she was told about how her body was developing, she switched to figure. And I think she's a beautiful body. Great details, you know. And um, she's an amazing woman. She's a woman of Haitian and Spanish descent. And it's just a beautiful combination of both um, nationality and ethnicities. I mean, you know, but like I said, she's been competing for quite some while. She made a pro debut around about 2018 and she competed at the uh, Chicago Pro. And she has a great physique, great lines. I think great quality. This is a good example of what we want to see in the sport of bodybuilding, muscle and femininity all together. Now, Capacity is originally from my Florida, but she's been living in New York for quite some time. And um, where, as you know, recently she just competed at the show, which was the New York Pro. She didn't do as good as she wanted to at the Pro, but hey, you know, she's still determined. And we have conversations, you know, I'm really going to get to learn about this young lady. I think that she's an amazing young woman who has determination to, you know, accomplish what she her goals. But like I said, you know, we're going to have a conversation tomorrow, on, you know, Sunday at 1 o'clock. If you're interested and want to, you know, you know, talk to her, ask her questions, you know, come by, swing by. I'm going to leave a link in the description. Also, on social media. And you know, for guys, you know my rules. You know, no D, pics, none of that stuff. I know she's a pretty girl. She's a very attractive young woman. And you guys get excited, you smokes out there. But Capucine is serious about this. She really wants to put herself out there, like, tell her for a story. You know, I'd love to get attention to any of these ladies. You know, especially someone like Capucine. Oh, my God. She just has an amazing body. She has a great look to her. I think she probably accomplished it. Maybe someday we'll eventually see her compete in the Olympia. You know, as the season's not over yet, there's still a few more shows. There's a lot more shows that um, there's more opportunities for a fixed competitor. And she has a lot of promise and potential. But like I said, um, swing by tomorrow at 1 o'clock. Um, you know, because she lives, in, like I said, she lives in New York. So that's the East Coast. That's perfect for me and that's perfect for her. Because sometimes I have to try to sub times between, you know, time zones like that. But like I said, I think she's an amazing young lady. She has a lot of potential to grow in the sport of bodybuilding. She has a future. I think she also has a great mindset for business. So I wish her all the best of luck. And also, I wish our, I wish we have a great interview tomorrow. And, you know, check us out. You know, like I said, it's going to be 1 o'clock. You know, uh, Eastern Standard Time, uh, 12 um, um, Central, uh, 11 Mountain, and uh, 10 Pacific. So that's for you early birds who want to get up and watch it, you know, and give you some time. So so uh, much respect to one Miss, the lovely uh, Miss Capucine Lecount. This is your man, always George Page, a.k.a. the Emperor of Female Bottom Talk. Like, don't like, subscribe, don't subscribe. I'm out.